What's up, everybody? I want to introduce you to this new sort of daily podcast launch that we're going to start this week. And I say daily, I'm going to do my best to post as many of these as I can. I would like to eventually get to the point where it's daily, um, and that's going to be kind of the goal over the next few weeks. But the idea here is that I have so much come across you know, my desk. I have so many different things that athletes approach me about and so many different messages that I try to share within those workouts. And they're small little tidbits, but I think they're really important things that all of us can learn from and hopefully all of us can use in our daily lives to better develop ourselves, um, use as self-improvement topics, and be able to really push towards our career goals and the different things we're trying to accomplish in our own lives. So for today's topic, I'm going to flow right into it. I posted this a few different spots on our social media. Um, Keegan Michael Key, who most people probably know from like the show Key and Peel, he's Key, and he's a very strong personality. He's a really funny guy. So most of the time, you know, people don't necessarily see him in a super serious tone or a super serious light, but he actually was giving a pregame speech to the Penn State football team. And so I came across the video, I posted it, I thought he made some really good points and had some insight that's really important for people to think about again on a daily basis, especially on a Monday when it becomes a little bit difficult to get back in the swing of things for a lot of different people. So Kind of the main topics that he hit on and the main topics that he covered related to like attitude and how your perception kind of can affect your daily routine and those sorts of things. And so, you know, the main piece of the quote that I posted on our Instagram page is always have a consciousness that says I will. If I'm not doing it now, I just haven't done it yet. So if we can have that mentality of like I will do something versus I can't or I won't, we're gonna be in a really good spot no matter how long that takes to accomplish that certain goal. And the same thing, you know, he talked to them about, you know, if you're not doing it now, it just means you haven't done it yet. If you're not an All-American now, it just means you're not an All-American yet. If you're not a Big Ten champion now or a national champion now, it just means you're not there yet. But that doesn't mean that you can't get there. And that's the biggest thing that I took is for all of us, regardless of where our goals are, regardless of how far we have until we get there, if we have that mentality and that consciousness that says, I will get there, not I can't or I won't, and if I'm not necessarily doing it now or I'm not quite there yet, it just means I haven't done it yet or I haven't gotten there yet. And the key word is yet. It means eventually I'm going to and I know I'm going to keep pushing until I do. I think that's something that's extremely important to think about. I think belief goes right back into that. and We've talked a million times about believing in yourself and having a belief in what you're doing and what you stand for. And I think it's important to think about those things. And the other thing that I commented on, and the last thing maybe I'll leave you with today on Monday is, you know, quite frankly, you may not be there yet. I'm not where I'd like to be yet. Most people aren't where they'd like to be yet. And none of us should feel that way. The day that you feel like you've arrived and the day you think you've made it is the day you start letting others catch up and surpass where you are or where you might be. If you get you know, ahead of the competition or you feel like you're in a good spot, you know, as a basketball player, you get some scholarship offers. As a business owner, you land a few big accounts. You start to get a couple promotions within your job, whatever it might be. The day that you get satisfied or feel like you've made it or feel like you've arrived is the day that you're going to really be in trouble. It's the day that you're going to let other people catch up to you and not just catch up to you, but surpass you. And so again, I think we all need to have that mindset that we aren't there yet. And we may never be. We've got to keep going. Every time we hit a goal or hit a landmark, we've got to keep pushing forward and keep having that mindset that we're not where we want to be yet. We are not a finished product, but we will be eventually. Stay hungry and stay committed to your craft work. I hope you have a great day and a great week. Thanks again for tuning in to today's episode. We really appreciate your support. If you enjoy the podcast, you enjoy some of the messages that we spread and what we've been talking about, please consider going to iTunes, subscribing to the podcast, and then leave us a rating or a review. We appreciate any honest feedback you have for us and look forward to hearing what you have to say. If today's episode was valuable or if you saw some value in today's message, please also consider sharing that with one to two other people who you think would see some value in it as well. That's hopefully how we can continue to spread the word, continue to build this great community that we already have, and again, organically just increase our reach and spread these messages that we kind of see as important.